hello guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video i want to show you how you can build a website using a free domain name and a free web hosting so when using a free domain name i would advise that you don't use the free domain name for a serious business because there are downsides to it so if you are using a free domain name it could be just to test run a site to see how it will function the analytics and all of that or maybe you want to Build a website, but you don't have money at the moment to buy a domain name and a hosting plan. So you just want to use this free plan and de develop the website, then migrate it later on to a paid uh, domain name and hosting plan. So if that is what you want to do, you can use a free plan and design your website from start to finish, and then you now migrate it to a paid domain name. Alright, so uh, without waste of time, I'll be showing you how to do this. And the platform we are going to be using is 000 Web Host. I did a video uh, last month or so on how to design a website using a free domain name on Infinity Free. You can check that video here uh, and you watch that. That's also another way to get a free domain name and a free web hosting. And there are several other platforms too. So, but uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to do this design a website with a free domain name and a free hosting with 00 web host. So, let's dive into this. So, just come to 00 web host. And then look at it. Click on it. Click on cheap web hosting to see their plans. So scroll down, then you now see free web hosting. But then they of course they have some other packages here. So, but we are going with the free web hosting. So, with this, you can create one website. You can have 300 megabytes disk space. You can have a bandwidth of 3 gigs. You will not be able to create a custom email. You will not receive any support. So, click on sign up. So, here you are going to put the, your website, your email address. So click on sign up. We send a confirmation in email. So open um, your email to verify. So I'll open my email. Let's look at the mail here. Click on it. So welcome. Click to verify. So email verified. So log into your account now. save your password <coughs> so welcome to this so let's create some magic click here so what would you like to do so maybe we want to create a blog we want to create a website we want to learn so we want to create a blog This blog is for what? What topic are you writing about? So this is uh, it's not very important for now because we are going to be installing a different thing. We're going to be installing a, a template. 
So, but you can just go ahead and select anyone. So maybe we are talking about business. You select it. This is your website name. This is your actually your domain. And uh, note that what uh, 00 web host is giving you is actually a subdomain, not a, a custom domain per se. It's going to be uh, a subdomain. So you now put in the name of the domain you want to use here. So maybe you want to use money sense. Money sense. So then our password. So click on submit. So another website with this name exists. So you just change this name. Maybe we put money. So let's use money sense. 01 money sense 01 submit so choose okay save this password so choose your weapon of mass creation we are going to use uh, wordpress so click on select of course if you have a, a website that is offline or you have a website you want to upload you can simply upload here to that web hosting plan or if you want to use the hosting uh, builder, you will use this. So we are going to select WordPress. So this is uh, your web WordPress login details. So you are going to create login details that you'll be using anytime you want to log into your WordPress to design your website or to do any updates. So you are going to put a password that you remember so okay they said there must be a capital letter so put capital letter there so now install so wordpress is being installed Congratulations, it's ready. So your WordPress has been installed. So go to configuration now. This is where you build your website. So just click on configuration. So we are trying to access our WordPress dashboard now. So put in your details. Remember, I'm so login. So, guys, this is your dashboard. So, you can simply come here. Okay, save your password. You can simply come here and visit your website. So, let's right click here and open a new tab. So, for now, this is what we have on our on our site this is what we have so but we are going to install a team we're going to install a team that will help you customize your blog in a better way to give you a more appealing appearance and some additional features so come back to your dashboard and come to appearance and then click on themes So we are going to add new team. So come here, search for Astra. Of course, without searching too, you can see it here. Look at Astra team here. So but if you don't see it here, you can simply come here and type Astra. Astra. Then it will come up. Look at it here. So install this team. Astra is a free team and it has a lot of uh, features that you can use. It allows you to customize almost everything on your website. So activate. As you can see, our team has been activated. So now come to plugins. 
we are going to install a plugin that will help us import a complete blog into our domain name and then customize it. Click on add new here. So the name of this plugin is starter templates. So look at starter templates here. Is it install and activate? So once we activate, come back to plugins here and scroll down. So look at starter templates here. Click on C library. This is where you can see a lot of templates that you can import and import a complete blog and use. So getting started with your template, scroll down a little, then click on build your website now. So there are three different kinds of page builders here. So select Elementor. So what type of website are you building? There are different kinds of templates here for businesses, local business, personal care, professionals, personal sites, communities, you see all these schools, events, church, e-commerce. There are a lot of e-commerce website templates here that you can use. So but we want to build a blog. So let's come to blog here. And select new site. Remember, we are building a blog for business updates. We'll be talking about investment and opportunities in the finance sector. So just click on new site. So, all the ones you are seeing premium on it are uh, paid templates. So, but this something like this is free because it doesn't have premium. So, if you have money and you want to buy, you can simply click on it, click on the premium, buy the team, and you make use of it. So, but for the sake of this tutorial, we are going to use a free template. All right, so let's select this, select this team, this template here. So, if you have a logo, you want to upload it, you can simply click on upload file here and upload the logo. But don't worry, we are going to do this later. So logo with you can arrange it there, you can set it there. So but don't worry, you do all of those things after installing your template. So if you can, as you can see here, this is our template. It's showing all courses. It's a learn, learn uh, school. It's for school, but we are going to edit it to suit exactly what we want. So. As you can see, this is a full website with several pages here. So click on skip and continue. So which colors would you want to use? These are the default colors. Or if you have any other colors you want to use, because once you select here to change on the on your template before you use. The same thing applies to your fonts. So click on continue. So we have an error here. Current PHP version does not match the minimum requirements for these plugins. So our PHP version is 7.2.31, but the required one is 7.3. So let's just go back and select another template because this is a free plan. Um, we cannot go in the process of upgrading this. And if it's a paid plan, you can simply mail the hosting company and they will easily do this for you. Of course, there are some other ways around it too. So, but uh, we'll just go back and choose another template now. So, come back. So, let's go with this. Continue. <coughs> Continue. So, okay, just one step, one last step. Uh, you can fill this form, but you can just leave it, submit and build my website.
So congratulations, your website is ready. So click on view your website. This is our website, this is our blog here with different pages, different categories. So all the content here, we are going to I'm going to edit and change everything to suit what exactly we want. So come back to your dashboard here. So when you come to pages, so pages, so look at the number of pages that came with this uh, template here. So all these pages can be edited. If you want to edit them, you, if you click on edit, it's going to be edited with WordPress editor. So but if you want to use Elementor, which is quite easier, you come to plugins, add new, search for Elementor, install. So after you install Elementor, you now go ahead and start editing your pages. So guys, that is how you can get a free domain name and a hosting plan on 000 web host. All right, so in my next video, I'm going to show you how to use Elementor to edit to edit your website, your web pages, make your website responsive. So if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and then hit the notification button so that anytime I upload that video and many others, you will be notified. Thank you very much. See you in my next video.